Got my eyes on the prize So my vision ain't cloudy You know my temple is pricey Now remember what I said The enemy has thrown out three D's out there Deception, disaster And what's the third one? Okay And so what the enemy does He wants us to conform he wants us to conform to the world. He wants us to, what makes us conform? Listen, young people will understand this more, much, 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 much better. If you notice, all of a sudden, young men will be wearing a certain kind of trainers because everybody's wearing them. Young ladies are doing this hairstyle or buying the same kind of hair, you know, wigs and whatever it is, that because everybody's doing that, that is the confirmation that comes because of the fashion that has been presented. And so what the world does, the enemy does, he's built a construct and he puts a fashion before us that is either deceptive, disastrous, or distressful to take our attention away from God. But we, the Bible says, do not be conformed. Do not be fashioned. Do not follow the trend. Do not be influenced, but rather be transformed by the renewing of your mind. Then it talks about, so hence, really, it is important that whenever we are doing things, let's start asking ourselves, where is this coming from? Does this build for God or is this building for the world? Praise the Lord. Because in the world, the world system will never build love, unity, and excellence that is for God's interest. Never. 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 For God's interest to prevail, we must be transformed daily. God's salvation is to be lived in us and to be lived out through us. And that depends on three things. Love, unity, excellence. Love is a function of life. And it's not just our life, God's life in our life. Praise the Lord. Unity is a function of our collective service unto God. And excellence is a function of our worship. Only the best. Why do you think, he says, that you should present yourself as a living sacrifice, acceptable, holy and acceptable. That means take away all wrinkles, all blemishes, the fact that you've got, you know, that, that if the ram has a, a broken leg, no, it's not good enough for God. Praise the Lord. And so whatever you do in your day-to-day -day living at home must be excellent because God is deserving of the best. Smitten like I'm in school, licking diamonds I'm shining fresher than cocaine With Jesus, I'm smiling, staying alive like PG's. Love is rich, I feel bougie Roll deep with Christ, call me Wiley God 